Hey guys, uh, we're back, and we're back with The Legend of Spyro, the Eternal Night uh, experience. Let's play on the Wii, so let's get going with the Grove, where we left off. Now I think, really dog, oh, okay, I don't know if you can see her, but she is walking around, hopefully not blocking the view. Oh, she's looking for her pillow, because Dad went to wash it. Or he took it away to watch it. But, okay, anyways, we're going to pick up where we left off right after, I think, learning about our ice abilities. So, I think that's where we left off. I don't know. So. Uh, yep, okay. Hey, no, no, leave it! Oh my gosh, you brat. Come on. Be nice, come on. Sailor Pacer. Who paces? Never mind. Uh, oh, I didn't notice this before. <laughs> this is a totally new area that I did not know about. Wow. Okay. Played this game twice around. Still the first time for everything. I think that is... I don't know if there's... I don't think there's anything. Oh yeah, this is one of the times where you kind of forget that you can use ice to go across, uh... Oh, fudge! You can go across water liquids with ice. No! Fudge you! How the frick dare you? Kill you. Grove worm. Dog, what are you? Oh, you're. Oh, no, you're not. You're chewing on your toy. You're chewing on yourself. Oh, shoot! No! I did not know that that would do that. And I think there's a quill, yeah, there's a quill up there, so we'll go get that. So kill you, and you, and... Oh, wait, I froze him. Cool. Okay. Now, I actually have gotten... Oh. Oh, wait, where are you guys still coming? Oh, no. Okay. Okay, so I actually haven't gotten this one before, um, but this is different because that happens. So you're going to want Dragon Time. Like that. Oh, and not fall. You can hurt yourself. Okay, what time we got? Okay, so we got... Okay, I might need that. 
I know that's technically cheating, but it really helps when you're playing through it um, after you've originally completed it. Because okay. there are a lot of uh, quills that I've missed in the past. Up and then he's just gone. I don't know what happened to him. So I don't think I saw him turn. Okay, that's not. Uh, oh, die. Yeah, he didn't come back down like that. I love that attack so much. It really helps you when you're surrounded by people because it just throws them up in the air and then keeps them vulnerable for a few seconds. Well, except for the music when you 
fight Gaul at the end. That's pretty good music too, but the music where you fight Scab um, at the end of the pirate section is really good. Maybe I can just hit him from here. Yeah, so you can just do that. Snake Fletcher. Okay, now I might want to move. Okay, and so now you're going to want to go over to the ship, because at first I had absolutely no idea where to go after that. Be nice! I'm supposed to be killing you easily! Okay, is it? I seem to remember there being more pirates attacking you. goes far. <laughs> could really uh, do a long range battle with the cannon that shoots that far. shoots right away. Yeah, he's never shot right away before. So yeah, you kind of need to hold down for about a second or two this time. Here, let me see. Yeah, like one second. Like a count of one. Are you kidding me? Must be better than this. I'm a freaking gamer for crying out loud. There we go. this video um what are you doing dude oh wow it's just like barely a nudge and he moves wow oh that's really sensitive i'm like hardly even touching the joystick wow well i hope you guys enjoyed this video um and i'll catch you next time peace out